Shalom family. Scientists invent anti-gravity device. Invent. Strong word because they didn't invent it. They were given this, but I'll get to that. This device could revolutionize transportation. And this, while they're busy making it harder and harder for normal transportation to continue. A scientist by the name of Charles Bueller claims that he and a group of scientists and engineers developed a device that defies the laws of physics in that it can propel itself without a propellant. Bueller, the co-founder of Exodus Propulsion Technologies, interesting name, right? A NASA electrostatics expert said that his team has been exploring propellantless propulsion for many years. Their work began in 2016 and has culminated with the development of a device that has the potential to revolutionize transportation as we know it. The nice thing about it, it doesn't use propellant, said Bueller, adding that the device does violate a lot of old classical laws like the rocket equation. So let me fill in some background detail you might have missed if you weren't a conspiracy theorist or somebody looking into the alien agenda and everything many years before it became cool. When the alien ships crashed, like 1947 in Roswell and in various other places around the world, South Africa, Russia, the UK, there's been various incidents, various crash disks found all over the place. Apparently demons can't fly, haven't done their test, haven't passed anything by the Federal Aviation or anything, and so they have issues. And when these things happen, these craft are collected by governments, mostly America, Russia, um, for example, the one that was in South Africa, we gave to America, but it's a whole different story. Um, so yeah, so they have this technology. They are then getting their best experts that they can trust, unknown drips under pressure. They bring them in and they give them parts, compartmentalized parts of the technology to go and backwards engineer and figure it out, which they have been doing for a long time. So like this scientist... Charles Bueller, him and his group, Exodus Propulsion Technologies, were obviously chosen to work on this anti-grav engine system that's used by these little flying disks that the Nephilim slash demonic entities are riding around in. And yes, I know I sound completely crazy. Bear with me. You don't have to believe it, but I really think this is the case. So as they have now worked on these things and discovered more and more and found ways to bring it into our real lives... They get told when they can release this information and start rolling this out, which is going to make them all rich and powerful in the process. In the meantime, though, the governments have signed and inked deals with these entities slash Nephilim because there's a lot of testimony, whistleblowers and stories coming out of these black bases around the world that says that they are dealing with these creatures and they have an exchange of knowledge. So this knowledge is going to become more and more apparent in situations like this to help control mankind in this final seven year window that we're barreling towards at an incredible speed. So there's my whole picture for you on what's actually going on. Good luck to them. None of that tech is going to help when Jesus comes back on a horse to just show them how ridiculous their amazing tech is going to be. Oh my God, Reigns. Shalom.